Have you ever stayed at an Airbnb or a hotel and thought, what if I could actually own part of it? Not by buying the entire property, but by owning a digital piece of it, like a share that lives on the blockchain. Imagine a world where luxury villas, boutique hotels, and vacation rentals aren't just booked, they're tokenized, where ownership moves as easily as a click, and real estate becomes as fluid as digital currency. That future isn't decades away. It's already starting to unfold in 2025. Today, we're breaking down exactly how it works, why it matters, and how it should completely change hospitality and short-term rentals as we know them. Before we dive in, just a quick reminder, this video is for educational purposes only. I don't offer financial advice or investment services. Everything you're about to hear is purely informational and focused on hospitality, short-term rentals, and technology innovation. Now let's talk about what's actually happening behind this shift. For decades, real estate has been one of the most stable and respected asset classes on the planet. Hotels, resorts, and villas have built fortunes and shaped cities but they've also been slow to evolve, expensive to buy, heavy on paperwork, and hard to manage. Tokenization changes that by turning ownership into something programmable, transparent, and accessible. So what is tokenization in plain English? Imagine a villa in Mykonos, a boutique hotel in Bali, or a beachfront Airbnb in Miami. Traditionally, one person or company owns it, manages it, and takes all the risk. Tokenization lets that same property be digitally divided into verified ownership shares, recorded securely on a blockchain. Each share or token represents a fractional piece of the property, with all the details like ownership rights and distributions tracked transparently. The beauty of blockchain is that every record of ownership and transaction is permanent and verifiable. It's not controlled by one person, not hidden in a filing cabinet, and not limited to one country's system. Instead, it's a shared digital ledger that anyone with permission can see. This transparency reduces friction, speeds up settlements, and helps build trust between owners, managers, and investors. Now let's, let's connect this to the hospitality industry. Think about how short-term rentals work today. You have an owner, maybe a property manager, in a platform like Airbnb or Verbo. Each one plays a role in collecting payments, handling maintenance and distribution of profits. It works, but it's fragmented and often inefficient. When you introduce blockchain into that equation, you simplify everything. Ownership, revenue distribution, and even property access can all be automated through smart contracts. For instance, let's say a luxury villa is tokenized into 1,000 digital shares. Each token holder might receive proportional rental income or perhaps even the right to book time on the property. The blockchain tracks every payout, every booking, and every transaction in real time. There's no confusion about who owns what. And the accounting happens automatically. It's fast, secure, and eliminates most of the manual reconciliation that property managers deal with every month. Now, hotels can benefit from this too. Imagine a boutique hotel that wants to raise funds for expansion. Instead of taking on more debt or selling equity to one large partner, they could issue digital ownership tokens representing specific revenue streams or profit shares. Holders of these tokens could receive transparent performance updates and revenue distributions automatically through smart contracts. It's a completely new way to structure participation, one that rewards transparency and accountability. In 2025, this conversation is becoming very real. Institutional investors, hospitality groups, and even governments are studying how blockchain can streamline property records, reduce fraud, and modernize real estate registries. For hospitality operators, tokenization means faster access to, to capital, global reach, and the ability to manage fractional ownership legally and efficiently. It's not about crypto speculation. It's about compliance and modernization. 
And for everyday travelers, the implications are exciting. Imagine booking a stay at a villa and realizing that you actually own part of it, that your loyalty gives you something tangible, not just points. Tokenization can turn guest loyalty into ownership participation. Think of it as a next generation of reward programs. Instead of points that expire, you have verifiable digital rights that can hold or even increase value over time. Now let's talk about the broader impact. For decades, real estate investment was reserved for those with access, institutional capital, large investors, or big corporations. Tokenization changes that dynamic by allowing verifiable frictional Fractional ownership, blockchain opens the door to broader participation while maintaining legal structure and control. That means someone in Singapore could hold a piece of a Tuscan villa and someone in London can own, hold a verifiable share in a boutique resort in Bali, all within regulated compliant frameworks. But let's be clear, this isn't about replacing the existing system. It's about enhancing it. Tokenization still relies on proper due diligence, management, and legal oversight. The blockchain doesn't run the property, people do. But it does bring a new level of automation that can reduce costs, improve trust, and make cross-border ownership far easier. From an operational standpoint, blockchain also helps with reporting and auditing. Smart contracts can log expenses, distribute profits, and maintain financial transparency across multiple owners or entities. This is especially valuable in the short-term rental market where there are often dozen of, dozens of trans, transactions per property per month. Instead of spreadsheets and man, manual payouts, everything can be codified into logic on the blockchain. In the next few years will be critical. By 2030, many expect tokenization to become part of a normal part of how hotels and short-term rentals operate. But the winners will be those who combine great hospitality with great technology. The blockchain alone doesn't create value. The experience, the brand, and the management still do. Tokenization just gives them a stronger foundation. Let's go back to Airbnb for a second. The company transformed how we travel by making accommodations accessible and personal. But beneath that model lies an enormous ecosystem of property owners, managers, cleaners, and service providers. Tokenization could eventually unify that ecosystem. Imagine every participant having verified access to their role, their earnings, and their ownership, all in one secured system. No disputes, no middlemen delays, no lost data, just clarity. And there's the potential for community ownership. Picture a group of hospitality professionals who come together to co-own a portfolio of short-term rentals. Through tokenization, each person's, person's contribution is represented digitally. Their profits are tracked transparently and decisions can even be governed through voting mechanisms built into the blockchain. It's efficient, fair, and empowering especially for small operators who want to scale globally without giving up control. Now you might be asking, what about the risk? Is it a smart question? It, this is a smart question. Blockchain and DeFi ecosystems have had their share of bad headlines, hacks, rug pulls, and regulatory issues. But tokenized, tokenized real estate is a different animal. When built under regulated structures, it operates like a traditional real estate with blockchain serving as the technology layer, not the market itself. Legal documentation, compliance standards, and audits still apply. And the difference is that everything is faster, cleaner, and more secure. Education is key here. That's why I make these videos, to help demystify what's coming. Because most people hear words like tokenization and immediately think of speculation or risk. But when you understand how it actually functions in the context of real assets like hotels and villas, you realize it's less about hype and more about better systems. Tokenization can reduce fraud, lower entry costs, and improve liquidity in an industry that is historically slow to move. Hospitality has always thrived on innovation. The industry that once relied on printed ledgers and phone bookings 
now runs on dynamic pricing algorithms and mobile apps. Blockchain is simply the next evolution. It's the, invis the invisible infrastructure that will make fu the future of hotels, resorts, and short-term rentals more transparent, connected, and efficient. For hoteliers and short-term rental operators, this technology offers new opportunities to rethink ownership, operations, and customer engagement. For guests, it means more trust, flexibility, and potentially new ways to participate in travel experiences they love. And for the broader real estate ecosystem, it means capital can move more freely while maintaining compliance and accountability. If you're watching this because you're curious about hospita where hospitality is headed, and an the answer is simple. It's headed towards smarter ownership. Tokenization won't replace management companies, developers, or brands. It will simply connect them in a digital layer that enhances what they already do best. So in 2020, as 2025 uh, unfolds, keep an eye on how blockchain and tokenization are starting to appear quietly behind the scenes in the hotel and vacation rental markets. The next time you book a stay, you might be, interest, you might be interest, interacting with this technology without even realizing it. And one day soon, the villa you stay in might not be a destination. It may be something you own a piece of. If you found this discussion helpful, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more educational content about hospitality, short-term rentals, and real estate innovation. And remember, this video is for educational purposes only. I don't offer financial advice or investment services. Any reference to blockchain tokenization or DeFi are purely informational and related to hospitality and real estate innovation. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.